Good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. Today is July the 9th, 2019, and this is my reading for my Leos, my kings and my queens. How y'all feeling this morning? If you're new to my channel, I welcome you here. Please do like and subscribe to my channel, and also leave me comments in the comment section down below, because I do read those, and I will answer you back. That being said, Leos, let's see what's going on for you guys today. So, either you're dealing with a fire sign, or you're definitely standing in your own you know, you're standing up in your own reading today. I see that somebody is definitely dealing with um, some type of temptation here that's going on in your life. Some of you are feeling like, hmm. I do sense it to see that some of y'all are going through some things. Because as I was shuffling, like the, the cards were stuck, my stomach were like a notch. So let's figure out what's going on with you guys. Okay, so definitely if you're dealing with, um, you're feeling bounded to someone or something, that could be drugging, drinking, um, anything that does an obsession has to do with that card. And um, I see that the universe really does want to bless you and you want to be happy. Or you could be dealing with another Leo here. Somebody's feeling very betrayed. Um, somebody feels like somebody stole something from them or they was being very deceived and manipulative. But you could be dealing with somebody who's like that, okay, because this is your reading. You know, in tarot, it's either or. You, you're very guarded at this time, Leos, in regard to a lover's relationship. And the moon card says it's going to highlight lies, deception, and deceit. Everything that's done in the dark will definitely come to the light. So you're going to be receiving a whole lot of clarity on some things. Your intuition is at an all-time high. And um, you're definitely thinking about moving. That's what I'm saying with the transition card. You're thinking about moving. Going on to something better. You have gone inside yourself. You isolate yourself. You think about people, places, and things. You do want a new beginning. You want new love. You want to be happy and all that good stuff. I see you've been working extremely hard. It's definitely going to pay off for you here. You have a justice card. Now, the justice card could mean that you're dealing with um, an air sign, a Libra, and you need imbalance in your life. Or you could be dealing with um, a court case that could be coming up. And I do see here with the Ten of Swords, somebody that took somebody to hell and back. But with the Justice card, it could say that you're going to get justice for something that somebody did that was filed to you. The Ten of Swords is saying that you didn't been to hell and back or you didn't took somebody to hell and back. But you're definitely your thoughts. Your thoughts are all over the place. But the good thing about whatever's going on that's bad in your life is coming to an ending. Um, harsh words. The Queen of Swords is here, and she, whatever when the Queen of Swords steps on the scene, she um says harsh words and things of that sort. So your words, you could have spoke to somebody in a harsh way, a harsh manner, or something like that, or somebody has been speaking to you like that, and um the words have been cutting deep. You have the Ace of Pentacles here. It talks about planting seeds. It also talks about new beginnings and things of that sort. So whatever you're working on is definitely going to grow for you. These are going to about to, it's going to flourish for you because all you really want is stability. You want to be happy. You want to happy home life and things of that sort. But right about now, you're going through something here. Let's see what this is. Somebody's definitely thinking about walking away from people, placing things that no longer serve you. Somebody's definitely getting on somebody's nerves here. And, um... It could be some third party situation going on that has somebody acting all fucked up and twisted with you. Yep, you definitely need to make a head of all decision in regard to whatever's going on. If you're in a third party situation, which is here, you have to make a head of all decisions. Like either you're going to stay and deal with this bullshit or you're just going to leave. You know what I'm saying? I know that some of y'all have been with somebody for a very long time, but I mean, is it worth your happiness? Somebody's definitely feeling left out in the cold here with this five of pentacles. And the magician said you've been trying to manifest some good things to come into your life. I mean, you can because you have all the tools, but you also have to be on the right frequency as well to manifest that. The will of fortune is definitely going to turn in your favor because you're destined for greatness here. This is a wish card too, so you can make a wish. But you're definitely looking um, for, for better things to come into your life in regards to a partnership. And I say a partnership is on the horizon here. But you got to go through the difficult part to get to this. So it's time for movement now. What are you going to do? It's time for you to make some decisions. You have other cards that came out. You could be experiencing a tower experience right now. This is an active tower where it's like you're going through something. It's like every time you turn around, it seems like there's something else. And you're like, well, what now? You know what I'm saying? It's like you're on a, on three different roller coasters at one time. You're up, you're down, you're up, you're down. And somebody, your emotions, you're all over the place. Somebody's dealing with heartache and pain here and disappointment with this three of swords. 
somebody's very disappointed and hurt. You're going through a very trying time. But this is a trial. This is a test, y'all. Leos, this is a test. So in order, you got to pass this test in order to get to your greatness. You see what I'm saying? You need to try to relax yourself. Try to retreat. Try to um, rejuvenate your body, your body, and your spirit. There's a water sign that's definitely coming in. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces here coming in towards you. I do see a new beginning here. I see you being um, very creative after you pass your test and whatever you create is going to pay off for you here this is the ten of pentacles so things are, some things you're going through something definitely emotionally somebody's taking you through a trying time and things of that sort but there's other stuff that's popping up as well secrets that you're not telling anybody about and things like that uh secrets that somebody else is holding for you but definitely is going to come to the light it's just things i mean you want a new beginning and things of that sort but like i said it's like with you know in life things go up and they go down so you have to deal with some things <clears throat> that can be bothering you right about now but try to look to the brighter side too because once you go over the hill look at it like a mountain you got to travel up this mountain it's hard to get up this mountain it's hard as hell you're sweating and all that shit but once you get to the top you can see more better you can see more clear things are going to look better for you and once you get to the top you it's, it's good you got it it's all good from there so, um, even though you may be going through something, Leos, trust and believe that things will get better for you. With that being said, y'all have a blessed day. Thank you so very much. Please like and subscribe. Comment to my channel. I thank y'all so very much. Have a very blessed day. Thank you.